a North Korean flag tanker seen from a distance at the Libyan port of Esida. It's allegedly been loading the country's crude oil. Rebels have held major oil terminals in Libya for months now. They're calling for more autonomy for eastern Libya and are using the country's reliance on oil to force government to bow down to their demands. The militants at Esida are accusing government of corruption. They vow to sell off the country's crude oil, posing a serious risk to Libya's economy and Prime Minister Ali Zidane's government. A ship called Morning Glory entered Libyan waters and docked at the oil exporting port of Esida. Of course, this is a violation of international law. The state of Libya has won the ship and with the embassy of North Korea, as the ship is flying their flag, contacted its captain by phone, but the captain said that an armed group jumped on the ship. He called them a militia. The Prime Minister is taking a tough stance, one that could have far-reaching consequences. The tanker will be bombed if it doesn't follow orders when leaving. This will be an environmental disaster. Shipping experts say it's rare for a North Korean vessel to operate in the Mediterranean. You deserve to know more. ENCA.com